Suppose A is a given matrix like that. It is a one process, no theory is there. It is a method. One process is there to find the inverse. That is why without uh, giving that theory part, directly I am coming to find the inverse. It is a method. Simply you apply this method. You try to understand it. A is a given matrix like that. Then A is equal to I into A now. I will do. By using uh, the elementary operations, using uh, using uh, elementary operations. Okay, the elementary operations are there. By using the elementary operations, in that elementary operation also, row is there, column also is there. But commonly we apply the row. By using that elementary operations, the A will become as I. On both sides, we are applying the elementary operations. By using that uh, operations, the A will become as I. Okay, now, by taking one example, we can understand. A become as I. And I become as some uh, a new matrix A. If A becomes as I means I does not become as A, that is a different one. I becomes as a X. And A is as it is. A is as it is. We will keep it as. Now you see A into X. A into X. X is some new matrix. A into just like A. A B is equal to B A is equal to I not like that. Here, I, it will become as I and it is a, I becomes as a X. Then AX, that means AX is equal to I, like this. Therefore, X is equal to, X is equal to A inverse. Okay, now, by using that concept, okay, now, by using that concept, we can uh, find the inverse of the, those matrices. Other. For the first one, solutions. Number one, given matrix, given matrix is capital A is equal to one minus one. 2, 3. Okay, no? It is a 2 by 2 matrix. Simply you observe. A is a 2 by 2 matrix. It is a given matrix. Actually, A is equal to I, A, no? Say, A is equal to I, A. I into any matrix is that matrix. Here, A is a 1 minus 1, 2, 3. And I is 1, 0, 0, 1. And A as it is A. It is A. Right? Okay. Now, we are applying. We are applying the elementary operations. What are those elementary operations? Already I told this given matrix will be changed as a I. I means here 1, 0, 0, 1. So the first one, this 2 will become as 0. Understand it. This 2 become as 0. 2 minus 2 only 0. You see, R1 it becomes as R1 minus 2 into R1. Will you agree? Not R1, R2. Okay, now. R2, this row, 2, 3. Here we have to make 0. R2, it will become as R2 minus 2 into R1. 
R2 minus 2 into R1. 2 minus 2, 2 minus 2 will give the 0. Here only the operations, elementary operations means the elements of second row will become as 0, 1. That is our concept. It must be 0 and it is 1. Directly at one time it will not, 3 will not become as 1. Slowly, first we change it. This 2, it must change as a 0. 0 means 2 minus 2. Here 1 is a 2 into 1 minus 2 by using that one. There are three properties. Row, row operations. That is elementary operation. The first one is related with row means oh, just we are changing the rows. 1 and 2. That is the first one. Second one is a we can uh, add uh, any element uh, of any other row with the element of another row. Okay now, here R2 second row, R1 is the first row. We are multiplying with a constant and uh, adding or subtracting. Okay now, like that. You see, here it is, uh, the R1 is uh, as it is, no change at all. Here it is 2 minus, it is 2 minus 2 into 1. Will you agree? 2 into 1. And here 3 minus 2 into minus. Okay now. Similarly, here also the same method. The first row not be changed. The second row, you see, it is 2 minus Sorry, 0 minus 2 into 1. Again, 1 minus 1 minus 2 into 0. Into A, A as it is. Here it is. Uh, 1 minus 1, 2 minus 2 is 0. In order to get 0, here. It is a 3 plus 2 is a 5. Okay, now. Whereas here it is 1 0, 0 minus 2 is minus 2, 1 minus 0 is 1 itself. Okay, now into A. Again, here 1 minus 1, 0 minus 5 is there. Here we are applying the R2 by 5. I am applying the R2 by 5. Why? Because in order to get a here 1. So 1, this is minus 1. 0 by 5 is 0. 5 by 5 is 1. Try to understand it. R2 by 5 means the elements of R2, elements of second row, divided by 1 by 5. 0 by 5 is 0. 5 by 5 is 1. Here also we have to apply. It is a 1, 0. It is a minus 2 by 5. And a 1 by 5. Okay, then uh, into A. This is A is a, as it is A. Okay, then. Here only in one step we will get the answer. Here you see 1 must be 0. But here is minus 1. 1, 0, 0, 1. In order to get 0 here, we simply minus 1 to plus 1. That means, try to understand it. In order to get here 0, minus 1 plus 1. Okay, na? minus 1 plus 1. It will become as 0. Here it will not be disturbed. 1 plus 0 is 1, 1. 1, here 0, 0, 1. So, what we are applying here? By applying, by applying, R1 plus R2. Try to understand. Here I am writing. R1 it will become as R1 plus R2. Okay now. R1 plus this R1 becomes it becomes as R1 plus R2. That implies you see R1 means 1 plus 0 is 1 minus 1 plus 0. 1, it is 0. Minus 1 plus 1, 0. And uh, it will not be changed. 
only the R1 will become as R1 plus R. It is as it is, zero, one. And here also same. R1 plus R2. That means, I have right here. One minus uh, two by five. How much? It is uh, three by five. Five minus two. So here it is uh, three by five. Okay, now. It is a uh, 3 by 5 by like that one and 0 plus uh, 1 by 5 it is a uh, 1 by 5 that R1 only changes and it is as it is minus 2 by 5 and it is a uh, 1 by 5 into A. Any doubt? Of course it is a, a difficult concept. Slowly, one or two times, you have to repeat it. All problems I will solve on both. So here it is a I, and it will become as a X. A is as it is. Okay, now I will write here. The continuation. That implies it is 1, 0, 0, 1 and it is a X. Clearly I will write in here 3 by 5, 1 by 5 and it is a minus 2 by 5 and it is also 1 by 5 into A. Okay now, it is a I is equal to X into A. Therefore X is a inverse. Okay, now inverse of A, we know that A, B is equal to X, B, A is equal to A, I'm sorry, A, B is equal to I, or B, A is equal to I, that means B is inverse, here B means X is inverse, therefore X is equal to, it is 3 by 5, 1 by 5, minus 2 by 5, 1 by 5, is A inverse, this is a, Yes, okay now. That is the problem. Yeah. Okay. Second problem. Given matrix A is equal to two one one one. 2, 1, 1, 1. You see here also, it is a, a is equal to i into a as it is. I have to write here that consider. A means it is 2, 1, 1, 1. i is 1, 0, 0, 1 into a. Here a is a, as it is. You simply leave it out. Now, <coughs> again, try to understand. This part will become as I. Automatically, what we apply here the elementary operation in order to make this A as I. Automatically, here also, by using the same steps, this will become as a new matrix X. That x is inverse. Simply observe. Here, <coughs> here is 2 is there. Actually, this must be, it must be 1. It must be 0. Must be 0. And it is a 1 as it is. Already 1 is there. So, in order to make this 2 as 1, simply by erasing 2 and writing 1, no, not that one. By using the elementary operations. Using elementary operations. Using elementary operations. That means applying. Applying, you see, R1 minus R2. 2 minus 1. There only we have to make with the help of other elements of other law. 2 minus 1. 
That means R1 minus R2. This meaning R1 is changed as R1 minus R2. Like that we have to mention. That means it is 2 minus this one. And 1 minus 1. And R2 will not be changed. It is as it is 1, 1, 1. Here are the same steps. Same operation will be taken place. 1 minus 0. 0 minus 1. Here is 0, 1 as it is. No change. It is 1, 0. If this is 1, 1. Here also 1 minus 1, 0, 1 into A. Okay, you now? You see, <coughs> it is okay. 1, 0, 0, 1. Here is the problem. It must be 0. Same applying eh? here also. Applying, you see, now. this is R2 as R2 minus R1. This R2 it is going to be changed as R2 minus R1. 1 minus 1 only gets 0. It is 1 0 na. 1 minus 1. 1 minus 0. Here are the same thing. 1 minus 1. No alteration in the first row. Only alteration in the second row. This is 0 minus 1. 1 minus half minus 1. Into A. Okay na? Now it is uh, 1, 0, 0, 1 uh, and it is 1 minus 1, minus 1, uh, this is 2 into A. Here this I is equal to X into A. That implies X. What is X here? X is nothing but uh, 1 minus 1, minus 1 to 2 is the A inverse. Okay, then. No, no. That x, automatically that x is a inverse. It is the inverse of a. Why? Because x into a is i. a into x is i. x into a is i. So here, <coughs> this x is 1 minus 1, minus 1 and 2. Okay, then? Like that we have to put. Okay? Right. Okay, third problem. Given is uh, capital A is equal to 1, 3, 2, 7. 1, 3, 2, 7. Consider, as usual, what we consider? What we consider this uh, A matrix is I into A na? I into A. You see, <coughs> what is I? A, A is 1, 3, 2, 7. And I is 1, 0, 0, 1. And A as it is. Okay. Here, you see that. Applying, applying, The operations that means elementary operations. Here one is there. In order to here one here is a zero here also zero and here is a one. We had to change by using these applications. One zero zero one. This a will become as a i. Automatically this i will become as not a x. Some other matrix will come. That x into a is i means x is the inverse of a. Like that. So here in order to make here, here is one okay, here two. It is two minus one, two minus two, not two minus one. You see, this r2 will become as r2 minus two into r1. Will agree? 2 minus 2 only gives 0. 2 minus not 1. 2 minus 2 into 1. Okay, now. So, here it is. Uh, 
It is one thing, it will not be changed. Only the change is the operation only about the R2. So R1 is as it is. Here 2 minus 2 into 1. Okay, now 7 minus 2 into 3. Here also we apply the same thing. It is 1, 0. 0 minus 2 into 1. 1 minus 2 into 0 into n. It is 1, 3. 2 minus 2 is 0. 7 minus 6. 7 minus 6 is 1. Okay, now. Here 1, 0. 0 minus 2 is minus 2. 1 minus 0 is 1 into n. Okay, now. You see that. Here 1, 0. Here uh, it must be 0. And uh, it is as it is 1 is okay. So our problem is to change this 3 as a 0. How it is possible? By applying. Applying. Okay now. R1, it is related with R1. R1 minus 3 R2. 3 R2. Will you agree? R1, 3 minus 3. 3. This 1 is multiplied by 3 and subtracted. So it is 1 minus, you see, 1 minus 0 into 3. 3 minus 3 into 1. Okay, na? 1 minus 3 into 0. 3 minus 3 into 1. It is as it is, not changed. Here also we have to apply, not for only here, but also. It is 1 minus 3 into minus 2. 0 minus 3 into 1. And this is a minus 2, 1 as it is into A. Okay, now? Right. It is a, 1 minus 0 is a 1 as it is. 3 minus 3 is a 0. And 0, 1. It is 1 plus 6 is 7. And that is a minus 3. It is a minus 2. And this is 1 into A. As it is, this is I is equal to X into Y, which implies, which implies X is equal to, what is X? X is 7 minus 3 minus 2, 1 is Y. Okay, now, if I is equal to X, that means X is simply what we required, that Y was. Okay, now. I is equal to XA now here. What is X? X is 7 minus 3 minus 2 1. That will become as a inverse of A only. You simply write like that. Okay now. Nice. Okay. Next. Sixth one. Capital A is equal to R given 2 and 5 1 3. Okay, now? Yeah. You see, all the matrices is not necessary to having to have the inverse. It is not the correct one. Only some matrices having the inverse. So that they call as a invertible matrix. You see, by seeing we can check whether it is invertible or not. In the 2 by 2 matrix only I'm telling. All are having same, but the top to one you see there none. Here, this is a not having the inverse. It is not inevitable matrix. Why? Right? Because you see 6 into 1. This method is applicable for only in the object two, not in the theory. 6 into 1 is 6 minus minus 2 into minus 3 minus minus 2 into minus 3 6 minus 6 is 0 okay now 
if that the product of this diagonal and this diagonal product of ad minus bc like that if it is zero then it will not have in the inverse the inverse of this matrix doesn't exist that is the meaning it is not an inevitable matrix and you will here see the 2 into 2 4 minus 4 here also not possible so those matrices are not inevitable matrices. Okay, then the remaining are all okay. Now we'll come to the problem.